River in China, where each year a massive tidal ball wave surges upstream at about 25 miles per hour. You don't expect to see massive waves here. This is not a breaking shore, this is a river. To give you a scale of the size of the waves, you can see the boats nearly being overcome by this massive, massive wave. Fortunately for us, massive waves attract daredevil surfers. I think this is a really great place for surfers because the waves seem to last a lot longer. They are also extremely powerful and large. This is probably very much a surfer stream. This wave ride made a giant splash on the internet with over one and a half million hits. So who's responsible for the Chinese River's massive wave? It's actually being caused by the pull of the moon because the moon has got a gravitational field. Okay, so if it's a naturally occurring phenomenon, why doesn't this wave occur all the time? This only happens roughly once a year in China. You gotta get the sun and the moon lining up. That's when you get the strongest gravitational pull because the sun is pulling very strong and the moon's pulling strong. So you get this huge pull, literally pulling the water up, and then you just have it happen perfectly in this one location where the geometry of the river is shallow enough, but comes down together so that it creates this wave and it just propagates down the river. You're seeing the influence of the force of gravity, the moon's pull, the sun's pull, right here on Earth in a tangible form. And that really gets me excited.